Hello and welcome back once again to Viking Whiskey. Today it's uh, a new whiskey, the Nacnean, I suppose it's pronounced. Um, uh, the organic single malt batch number one. Uh, three year old whiskey, so quite young, but they gotta start somewhere, right? Um, and this one um, was, uh, it was produced by vetting 14 different casks. Uh, two thirds of them uh, were STR wine casks and one third ex bourbon casks. Um, and bottled at 46%, which is well, it's better than 43. <laughs> um, so this will be interesting. The pricing is ridiculously high for a three years, uh, three year old. So I hope there is something to it. Let's find out. Details are on the screen right here. All right. Very light colored. Very light nose. Um, there's some fruity notes. Like a little bit of fresh apricot juice, maybe even a bit of uh, grapefruit. Then there's definitely caramel toffee. Also a slightly off note. Yep, which is, I suspect, from the wine casks that wine casks they don't generate a nose that I am fond of um, I don't know it's like there's something musty and woolly about it but you also do have your um, uh, vanilla and light honey but everything is very very light as would be expected from a whiskey this young um, let's have a taste All right, alcohol is not very aggressive. Um, first off, there's some peppermint and toffee. It's actually very minty fresh. Um, and then on the second wave, there are those whiny notes that um, this just feels sort of musty and that wine, the red wine, um, sort of richness, it, it um, just doesn't fit well in a whiskey for me. Um, after that, here comes all the, the youthfulness, um, freshly cut grass, sort of aggressive oak, not enough barley missing the malt flavor. Um, hmm. Sort of mainly sour and bitter notes here. Let's have the second one. And the second two, a little more sugary stuff. A um, bit more toffee. Actually quite a lot of sweetness coming out here. Um, but not a lot in terms of flavor. It's just getting sweeter, like sugar water. Mm -hmm -hmm. 
that mint still there. It's fresh and sweet. Hmm. Last one. On the third chew, there is a little bit more complexity here. Um, some very light ginger, some black pepper. And that sweetness is getting richer, developing a little bit more. Um, but still, the main flavor is refined sugar, and that's... Mm, not really my thing either. Hmm. So, what do we have on the finish? Very, very light smoke. Very light. Toffee. Loads of white sugar. Peppermint. Light ginger. And just the vaguest note of that red wine mustiness. So, rating this fella, the nose, that's a solid 75. Taste-wise, it's drinkable, but um, really nothing <laughs> special, to be honest, and, and not very good either. Um, so, 74, finish, hmm. finish is all right, there's nothing wrong with that, 78. So, average would be 75, sorry, I'll redo that. Seventy six. <laughs> it's been a long day. <laughs> All right. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. See you on next. Uh, sorry about that. I'll see you on the next one. <laughs> Cheers.